This is the straight apple tart Delta 8 vape. So if you saw my Thin Mints review, you may think this was a similar experience, but you may want to stick around for this because it was wildly different. So we got the receipt here and it looks like they price gouged me. The last one was 20 bucks and this one was 23. So they did raise the price by $3, but $23 for two grams is still the best deal out there. Whatever change to the product justified the cost, I am not sure because I tried to open it from the top. It was just impossible to open this time. The last one just slid right out. Ugh, this one did not want to do that for me. It's the same disposable as last time. It's very sturdy, feels good to hold in your hand, nice and heavy. This thick glass isn't gonna break. I've dropped it like seven times and it is still doing fine. But I especially like how you can see how much fluid is left because some of these vapes don't make it obvious. And this is for sure two grams. You know you're not getting scammed. This is what it's gonna look like in the store on the shelf. But if you wanna see the back, feel free to take a picture of this, zoom in, read whatever you want, scan that QR code, and maybe you could find yourself some labs. Whenever I said it's heavy, I don't mean it's uncomfortable to hold. Do you see these little marks right here? Those are actually bite marks because what I like to do is just sit there and hold it. It's not so heavy that it like falls out of your mouth. It says the flavor is apple tart. It's really just doo-doo flavor. It tastes horrible. I don't taste even a hint of apple in there. Now with the Thin Mints one, I expressed that it never got stuck, but for some reason the apple tart, whenever I go to hit it, it has that little air pocket in there. I don't know if they put something inside of the liquid that just gives it a flavor that's messing up the composition, but it's getting stuck all the time now. We'll see if the preheat actually works on this one because on Thin Mints it didn't. and it still does not. The preheat just doesn't work. USB-C charger is nice. I only had to charge it twice and it lasted its entire lifespan, so that's a good note. I think it's about time I go over my biggest problem with this one. I don't know what it is with these exotic flavors and fruity flavors like apple, but whatever they put in there to try and give it the flavor completely changes the composition of the liquid. All in here, every single time I hit this thing, I get some sort of fluid stuck in my throat and it's not the liquid. It may be mixed with the liquid, but there's some chemical in here that's igniting like I don't know my polyps in the back or something that makes this nasty salty <laughs> you might not want to hear that but I'm being honest this is the review with Thin Mints I just sat there and smoked it no problem if I hit this like four or five times I'm get I'm gonna have to spit I'm gonna and it's just not a good deal. I don't know what that is, but I would love for them to fix it. In terms of its effects, it's just Delta 8. We know that Delta 8 isn't the most powerful thing you can smoke. If you wanna get really fucked up, go get some like D11 gummies or something, I don't know. But for, for what it's worth, you can hit it, you can get high. That's my routine in the morning. I wake up, I smoke, take a hit right to the face and just start smoking while I'm getting ready for the day. And then I kind of coast on that. It definitely has the power to take the edge off for a couple hours, but again, with that throat effect, you really don't want to smoke it a lot. I really hate to say this because Thin Mints was the first 10 out of 10 on the channel, but Apple Tart is so much worse. This has got to be like a 4 out of 10. So if you're in the smoke shop, you see these things next to each other, uh, go ahead. Forget that one, get Thin Mints. But anyways, that's gonna do it for the straight Delta 8 Apple Tart 2 gram disposable. Thanks so much for watching. If you like this video, feel free to subscribe. But other than that, y'all, that's gonna do it for me today and I'll see y'all later, bye.